Dun, dun, dun. Welcome to Survival Episode 2. We are going to record here on the lovely Survival the server. Of course, they don't know that, so shh, don't tell them. We'll let them find out on their own. Anyways, I think we we're out ready for a little exploration. As you can see, I have upgraded to the loveliness of diamond armor. I have yet to get enough netherite to convert it yet, but all of this came through voting. I can even show it off just real quick. Let's go into inventory. Look at this blast protection. Look at all the survivors just play. These all came out of the survivor crate. We can go ahead and put the helmet on. How about there? Alrighty. We're ready. I'm going to today, I'm going to give you a little bit of progress on where we're at. You look at the map, you can see I've done some work. Um, probably work on that together. But I also kind of want to give a synopsis of the server before I get too far. Uh, I spoke with the I spoke with the server owner. He doesn't seem to mind. So we're just going to give a brief synopsis. Okay, as I know, the server is called Survive. The server, sorry, let's try that again. The server is called Survive With Us. And it's actually pmc.survivewith.us. Kind of a cool thing. They have six realms, if I remember correctly, that you can choose to play on. All color-coded. I'm currently playing on the green realm. There is a tutorial, as I mentioned before, that kind of shows you how to do things and go on from there. And so on and so forth. Let me get out of first person view and go outside. I had to move my little cave for safety reasons. I'll sneak around here. As you can see, I have made progress. So quick, I'm going to do this real quick. I've gotten, I kind of did uh, the base of the floor. I'm kind of set it up. I had to move my storage up here. One thing I keep getting out of the store, out of the vote crates and the daily crates and all that are shulker boxes. So not hurting for shulker boxes at all. No, really not. Uh, I I managed to make some of the, Oh, oh, we're getting attacked. No, break out the sword. Ah, he's hitting me. Run, kill, kill, kill the skeleton. That's kind of redundant, but come on. Oh, there he goes. Whew. Let that XP just use, hit the mending up, fix that sword. And as you can see, I've got 169 levels. Now, the reason for that is every time you vote, you get 10 experience levels and they have seven voting sites so voting in a day will get you 70 levels to work with for enchanting so this is what i've got going so far i did the floor plan um i've kind of marked out with the brick base of where things are going to go i need to swap out the floor i'm thinking this will be my kitchen area this will be kind of an i'm not sure what what exactly i'm going to do here oh look arrows in the shadow um but this is going to be a this is going to be kind of a glass wall dining room, I think. I like this. It'll let you kind of look out here and just kind of view. Now, this server, unlike others I've played on, has not dumbed anything down. There are phantoms that will come out at night if you don't sleep, hence the little hidey room. And, yeah, <laughs> it rains. Um, I have not seen anything uh, re removed. All right, so what I'm going to, my plan's up here, and this will come in later. I've run it. I've got a staircase that's going to go up there. It's going to be an upper floor here. I mentioned that previously. I'm thinking also I'm going to run it up and go the other way and do another floor up there. Kind of make it a three-prong house. Beyond that, well, there's your preview of what I've got going on right now. Uh, as you notice, the tools have upgraded. I managed to get... Now, this one I did through enchanting. This is not anything fancy. I did this through, the, um, through luck of enchants. This, on the other hand, came out of a crate. As you can see, it's not unbreakable. It does have, and it doesn't even have mending on it. So I do have a spare book though. I may, I've got room. I may put it on. And this was just luck of the draw and chance as well. Uh, this was not, but as you can see, there's so much stuff on this. I can't sneak mending onto any of them. So when they break, they break. That's just about all there is to it. Though apparently you get so many slash fixes. And because I am playing on the server and doing the vids, I went ahead and, get, and did a donation. Not, you know, I didn't go nuts. Um, I'm up to a legendary rank, which gives me a slash fix a number of times a day. It's not like it's on a cooldown of all oh, you can do is once a day or once in every three hours or so. I think I get five. So five times in a day I can use slash fix. So if the gear gets down to where it's almost busted, I may go that route just because, I mean, it's perfect diving helmet. It's perfect diving boots. Uh, yeah, I I may just do that. All right, as I said, as I promised the other day, uh, I do want to kind of show off the crates a little bit. But like I said, I was doing a kind of a synopsis. There's the tutorial, our six realms. 
They've got custom enchants, as you've seen. They have got, I mean, the voting system is epic. And here's the, here's the big thing. Here's the big kick. Here's the big seller. All right, so I'm going to do slash crate. Oops, there we go. Here's what, if you vote or if you manage, to, if you're here for a vote party, by the way, the votes across the realms all seem to count towards the vote party. So that actually happens quite a bit throughout the day. So if you're playing throughout the day, you have a good chance of getting a lot of keys and you end up with daily keys. And look, I have now got 14 daily crate keys, uh, seven mob spawner keys, seven survivor keys. I don't have any. Now the master and the mythicals, as you can see, you have to purchase them from the store. You also have to get the fun crates from the store. So yeah, you do have to spend money if you want the stuff that's in these. I mean, you can look at it. Here's the Bastion stuff and the Master stuff. But see, where my thing said it was a Master's, this is not where I got it from. So I don't understand. I don't know. I Anyway, the master stuff, I've not. See, because this is a different thing too. Master's, whatever. Uh, did not get a key out of this yet. This would be, I think this would be kind of interesting. I would like to get one of the Tridents. Um, not got anything of the mythicals yet either, so it'd be nice to get some of these keys. All right, and then there's the vote. I've got seven votes because I already went ahead and voted today. Let's show you the vote stuff. We'll run through here: bottle of enchanting, five extra claim chunks because you use chunk claiming, iron ingots, our a double XP, um, survival tokens. Which I'm not. I, there's a way you can do that. I haven't really explored. I may put that into a different video. Our double money, mass, a master crate key, stake, two mob spawner keys. Uh, this, is, this is where my survivor gear came from. Uh, three survivor crate keys, um, and then there's some tools. So let's let's use one and just here's how this works. And I love the music; it's different every time. And we got one hour of double XP. Let's try one more to see if we get an item. Well, ding 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 ding. I let it go. Not an item this time. This time we got an extra claim chunk, which means I can claim one more chunk than I could before I did that. One last quick, and then I'm going to save the rest of those to do off camera. And oh, this time an hour of double money. All right. I don't seem to be having any luck of the roll on those just right now. Um, I am going to duck over here real quick because it's night, and I don't feel like being attacked while I'm trying to rest the key. So we're going to go into a little hidey hole. And we're gonna and then see I kind of accidentally broke through there. But that's okay. This is end up gonna end up being torn down anyways. Alright, now if you get a legendary key, I think that's what it is. Um let me let me check that. No, that's not it. Oh, I think it's legacy. Legacy key? Yeah, alright. This one you actually type a special command in for. People apparently really want this stuff. Rabbit boots, boots of the hollowed. I've gotten one key so far and I got the legs. Legs of the hollowed. All I got is protection X. I'm guessing, and they're unbreakable, so yeah. I may switch over to the pants on that. I need these four the clovers. This is what everyone seems to want on this server. All kinds of cool stuff. All right. See, you can go back, but look, it's not here to click from here. You have to type in the command. All right, we tried that. Let's show off a little bit of the dailies. We'll do a few of these. I really want this. I want the netherite ingrates. I have yet to get that, and I've opened a lot of these. See, look, there's the shulker boxes. Blue and cyan. I get those a lot. All right, here we go. All right, ding, ding, ding. We're across out. We've already lost out on the nether, right? What are we going to get? It looks like, oh, more glowstone. No, that's a good thing because there's no MC in the Oh, we already lost that again. Glowstone's gone. And, oh, what do we get? This time we got an, another hour of double money. It says it's rare, but it's not that rare because it happens a lot. And we're going up. Oh, it's already gone. This, ooh. I don't think I've gotten that before. Celestial Elytra. Blast Protection 5. Fire Protection 5. Infinity Protection. Good grief. Okay. I might be selling that because I'm, I'm not really a big fan of Elytra. Let me sell that for some money. And, and are we going to get lucky? It's still there. Oh. And we got more of those. All right. Um, all right. We're going to back off of that just so I can demo the mob spawners. And this is what you get. Look at this. A blank spawner and all of these different spawn eggs. My assumption is, I haven't clarified this yet because I don't really have the space to do it. I haven't set up a space to do it. Is that you can use an egg to turn a blank spawner into that spawner. So let's see what we get this time. Ding, 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 ding. Uh, we're going to get... Oh, we're going to get the actual spawner. Hey, all right. I was kind of hoping for one of those yesterday. It didn't happen. All right, we're going to try again. 
Alrighty, right, 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 right. Oh, we got a mushroom spawn egg. Alright, we're gonna try one more. Just, just for, just for the shiggles. What are we gonna get? What are we gonna get? Oh, this time we got a spider spawn egg. Alright. Alright, now we'll, now we'll demonstrate the survivor crate key. So this is where more, we get some of the survivor stuff. This is, I've gotten it from here too. Marauder gear, some master tools. This, I think this is where my master shovel came from. Yeah, this is where. Yeah, this is where it came from. Uh, I have yet to get that. That happens a lot. Spyro bucks. That's the end game server. I don't understand. Oh, I know why that is because the owner's name is Spyro. I makes sense now that you think about it. All right, are we ready to try this? Hold on, I gotta ask my friend over here, dude. Are we ready to try this? Almost ready. Let's try. Okay, Elmo. You click it. Okay. <laughs> By the way, in case you're wondering, that is not a voice changer. I can actually do that on my hands. Ooh, we got a sword. Master's Cutlass. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? I may have to use that some because hmm, that's better than the one I got. Let's try this one more time. Come on, Elmo. No, seriously, that's not a voice changer. I get this. I get the chest piece a lot. I have a number of these chest pieces. All right, we're going to try one more time. One more round. Here we go. Come on. Good stuff. Good stuff. Oh, the pants. Pants are good. So I was liking it. That'll give me a backup pair. All right, I will put, I'm will. i going to do the rest of the crates off camera because you don't want to just sit here and watch me roll crates. No, that's not, that's not a, lot, it's a lot of fun. All right. Now, they do have the ability to set homes in the nether. So I'm thinking I want to go to my mine and see if we can't pick up some more nether rights. And so I, I didn't really look out with the crate. So home. Oh, look at See, and it tells you. <laughs> uh, I have one called nether mine. We're going to go there. As long as it's going to be nice. Yay, it worked. All right. Last time I tried this, it put me somewhere completely different. I had to relocate my mind. All right. We're going to just pot it. We're going to use this pick and we're just going to bust through. Oh, uh, what do we got? Some soul sand. And now I don't have TNT. I don't really have any spare beds yet for any of the you know, explosive mining version. I've just been digging and hoping to hit it. I've managed three. Yeah, three ancient debris so far going up this way. And I may come back down this tunnel with some TNT or beds. Assuming it's not turned off, I don't believe it is. But I saw some exploded tunnels back that way. So my guess is that that's an option. And then I, and I've also been collecting the black stone when I need it. Right now I'm pretty good on this stuff, but yeah. I like to do this. I come down to Y level 9 on in the nether and I just this is how I mine for stuff. Also Amazing way to get graphic, but <laughs> shovel is not running silk, which the other one I have does. So of course all I can get is flint, because this has got what Fortune five on it. Oh, remember that pick that I'm using, the one that's unbreakable. I managed to choose with a Fortune five. Oh, yeah. Look, all the quartz from that, because that gives you yeah, twelve quartz. Let's see. I'm at 12, right? Yes. So let's test it. Uh, oh yeah, that gave me 5 from 1. Uh, oh, that only gave me 1 from 1, so the quartz is kind of random that way. Alright, back to this. We're looking for the stuff. And you know what? I kind of need the quartz. Quartz is always nice. More so if you're doing redstone, which I like to do. I did have a portal up, which obviously is how I got here in the first place. But they don't have a... St they don't have it set up to where um, the zombie pigmen and piglins and all that don't. Ooh. Ah, ah, stop it! <laughs> okay, that was that was dangerous. Must be careful. Okay. All right. How big of a lava pit is this? I'm looking at the map. Oh, it looks like I've hit a pretty decent thing. Oh, this may stop my tunnel. Oh, I'm gonna have to turn and go the other way. Because there's no way I can. Yeah, if. Wait. Oh. Hmm. Looking at that map. I might be able to sneak through that, but the trick would be to stop off the lava, and that's just. Nah. I think we're gonna turn. We're gonna go this way. As nice as that tunnel was, we're just gonna turn it. Because, oh, oh, no, no. And get it quick. Back. Run! All right, whoa! Man, I don't, I mean, this armor is awesome for that, but I just don't know. But we'll, we'll just prevent the burn damage as much as possible. Save on the food and all that. 
The only reason I have this much steak, to be honest, is because of the vote crate keys. I haven't done a lot of food hunting yet. Um, that, and I had one player who was being very nice. He was, he asked if I was looking for jungle saplings, and he brought me a bunch, and I was like, thank you. And he tossed me a whole bunch of steak, and I was like, well, dude, I really need that, but I'll, I'll take it. Like, I was still running on the vote steak, so that's just a shout out to how nice the people on this server are. Cause I just I didn't ask him for that. I was just was looking for some jungle saplings because I want some jungle wood for the house. I like to at least, or I don't know, I probably put the jungle into the barn when I get to that point because I do want to have a barn for sheep and cows and all that. Oh yeah, I'm just pure. That's the problem with uh, fortune picks and gravel. What do you get to flint? Flint? I mean, I, I, I dare you to tell me another use for flint besides flint and steel. Because there really isn't. I mean, gravel's nice because you can make coarse dirt, you can make concrete. Where does flint come in beyond... Well, I guess you can use it to make arrows. Okay, I apologize for that. You can make arrows. Not something I normally do because, you know, gathering feathers, you gotta run around and kill the chickens. Like, come here, chicky chicky, I just want your feather. Come on. Oh, don't do it. I'm sorry, Elmo. I'm, I'm really sorry. But no, I, I really... It's just... All that chicken hunting. Now, I guess you could have a farm. See, I've set up chicken farms before, and all I get are... Well, I usually do for the egg collection. I guess I've never done one for collecting the meat and the feathers. I may have to do that. That would be helpful. And then I could have... Because I managed to get a really awesome um, bow out of the crates. So I may do that just so that I've got the arrow supply. Alright, we are around that lava pit. Let's go back here for a sec. Eh, eh we're just going I was gonna go back to the same position, kind of the same position, but it's fine. We'll be alright. We're just kind of mining. All right, it's been long enough. I think we could go back to the to the house. My inventory is kind of getting full there, so home base and whoop, yep, sun is up or the sun is coming up. Yay! I face the house east, so it'd be easier to tell. All right, I love. Look at this. I mean, all these shulkers. I, did I get another one? No, I didn't. Oh, Alright, so this one, that's my gravel chest. Of course, I didn't get any gravel that time. All I got was flint. This is my nether chest, but things are running a little full. See, there's my three ancient debris. Um, that's sand. I started changing colors on them because I didn't want all just blue and, uh, you know, blue and cyan. So I started changing some of the colors. I need to do more mining. My lapis is... And there is the iron armor I was wearing in the first video. Just about dead. I'm thinking I'm going to set up an armor stand once the house is built. And just kind of put it on display with a sign of, you know, first armor. But look, see, I keep getting these survivor chest plates. So I got lots of those. I do have this sword. And I kind of want to combine them just to see if I can get the fire aspect onto that sword. Because that would make it kind of a better sword. I like that. Alright, we're going to stick that away. I don't really need to add to the light just yet. Oh, you know what? Ah, there it is. We can put the spawn stuff away. I've been trying to keep this stuff separate. Obviously, I mean, I prefer to stay organized if at all possible. Uh, what do we got over here? That's, okay, that's that. This is just kind of a hodgepodge chest. I think we're going to put this elytra and armor and stuff in here. Along with the quartz and the flint. Um... And the shroom light and the gold. Okay, we'll leave that. Now, what do I got here? Ah, there's my clay. I had to go digging for clay so I can make all these bricks. There's my cup. Actually, I'm gonna put this one away. Do do do. Around here, got some more. Oh, sometimes it's just you, before you get the vault going, it just seems like you start to overflow. All right, I don't need these and put them away. Put the, put that away. And somewhere I've got a blackstone chest to do that too. What are we doing? Okay. Oh, I missed a couple of these. I didn't realize I'd done that. All right, let's go put those away. All right, I'm gonna keep two out. Just I'll show you why in a second. Let me go put all these over here. I'll um, check my time. All right, we're all coming up on 20 minutes. So this video is gonna be wrapping up shortly. I I try to keep them somewhat short. Okay, that gives me a guardian spawn egg. Something I didn't have before. Also, if you manage to collect a wither spawn egg, those are a hot commodity. People like those. I sold one for some. I sold one to someone the other day for fifty thousand in game cash. Uh, my balance after voting, yeah, hundred thirty-four thousand. So yeah, pretty easy way to make money. Also, you get money for killing mobs and doing stuff. Also, 
I think this is the command. Yep. If you can go into quests, you get daily quests. Kill 50 cows. These are today's quests. They change every day. It's not always the same one. Play. Though that one seems to be on all the time. Kill 25 Vex. Yeah, because I'm going to go hunt down Vex. Have you ever tried killing those things? No, thank you. <laughs> 50 blazes. That would take some serious armor. Uh, catch 100 fish. Okay. That's a weekly thing. Chop a thousand wood. I've gotten the play one. Uh, breed 100 animals. Okay. Kill 250 phantoms. As you can see, I have nine. <laughs> it's one of the weekly things. Um, but if you get all if you get all these in a day, you get 20,000 and three hours of double money. If you get all these within the week, you get 20 boss keys, 20 daily keys. Yes, and they do have bosses. I forgot to mention that. Where you, when it's, it'll announce it, and then it'll be like slash boss to go do this. All right. Well, I'm going to call this for today. Sorry, I had to look down for a second. Thank you for watching. This is my beautiful beginner house. Stay tuned. Um, I think on the next one, I'll show some of the construction as I go along. But other than that, I'm just going to keep working on it and show you guys some progress as we go. Remember to subscribe if, you've enjoy if you're enjoying these videos. Give me some likes. Leave some comments if you have any ideas, suggestions. Uh, somebody actually gave me an idea. It's not in one of the comments. They kind of sh shot it to me on Discord. I do have Discord. Same username as in here, Calendor. In fact, I've linked the accounts. Um, his idea was he wanted to know if I was going to do a town. And I said, well, maybe in a future video. I'm this, Now, this is a possibility. I'm not promising to do this just yet. But maybe in a future video, I'll do something where I will invite some people to come on and participate in building a town with me on a server or maybe i'll do a different realm on this server and build it and just build kind of a small town and have people join and they can do the things and then i can showcase what they've built i kind of like the idea it's kind of a work in progress we'll see where we're at all right well we're going to call it quits Elmo, say goodbye to all the nice people goodbye everybody okay Elmo, we're gonna go y'all have a great day and keep playing and stay creative